Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today is August 25th and if you're new here, this is the fourth video in a series where I track my progress towards monetizing my channel. Thank you for being here and to all of the new subscribers, thanks for choosing to follow along. I really appreciate you guys being here. And I wanted to start off by talking about just how my week went. I had a pretty good week. Things went well. I gained some followers. I gained or I got uh, you know watch watch hours. Uh, if you're not aware, requirements for joining the YouTube Partner Program is 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours in the last year. And as of last Sunday, I was at 492 subscribers and 1,335 watch hours. And as of today, August 25th, I'm now at 524 subscribers and 1,379 watch hours. So things are looking up, things are still progressing in the right direction. I have green up arrows on all of the important metrics on all the analytics. So the green arrows, what that means is that for that period of time, your channel is performing better than it has historically. So it's only looking at your channel. It's not looking at anybody else's, just your analytics. So performance is up, that's great, great news. I feel like I'm running out of things to talk about in these videos. This is the fourth one in the series. And in the first one, I felt like I had a lot to talk about. I had a lot to share. And now each week, I feel like I'm having less to share. I mean, sharing the analytics is like the main part of these videos, but I also want to talk a little bit about what I've learned through the week, what the experience was. But for the most part, it's I don't have anything new to share. What I would like to try doing is batching more of these videos and not just the Sunday roundup. I would like to batch my monthly videos instead of trying to do two videos over the weekend and get them out during the week. So that's something I might try doing and I might actually switch this Sunday uh, analytics review video. It might become monthly because at this point, the subscribers are still growing at about a pretty steady pace. It, the rate of increase is it's increasing a little bit every week. So that's great, but I am gonna hit, I'm pretty sure if I continue this, I'll hit 1,000 subscribers before I'll hit the 4,000 watch hours and the watch hours seem to be crawling. They're going up, but they are moving at a snail's pace compared to how many subscribers I'm getting each week. So I think for that reason, like I might have more value to deliver if I cut these down to monthly and try something new. And that might be that I batch these files to get all at either the beginning of the month or at the end of the month and then I can send them all out to be edited and then I will have them available to, to post during the month. But trying to do these every weekend, it's becoming kind of a logistics challenge just with everything else that happens in life. So I think that's gonna add more value is batching these for both for me and the videos themselves will have value and I'll have more value to add in them. Like basically the reason is because I think I'll I'll be able to, you know, be a little more strategic, put more thought and planning into each video because right now I'm just running like one week to the next and I'd like to be able to plan out longer. So that's what I've been thinking about today. I just thought about that today or other. So that's what I've been thinking about lately. So the video that I put out last Friday, I think that's the skit, the skit that I did last Friday. And that seems to be doing pretty well. I think it's got over 400 videos now. Okay, it has 445. And then I put out a tutorial on just two days ago, Friday. And then the video that I put out uh, just two days ago, Friday, that one has about 20 views. So not that many, but I feel like I've noticed that is the pattern. Releasing them on Friday and then over the weekend, videos don't seem to get that many views. And then during the week, they seem to pick up in views, which is surprising because I had thought that weekends were when your videos would get most views, but that doesn't seem to be what's happening for my videos. Maybe it's just, I I haven't done very many. So that might actually be what works for other people, depending on you know their channel traffic, what kind of videos they're putting out. But so far, yeah, mine don't get that many on weekends and then they usually pick up during the week so far. I'm gonna try batching thumbnails because I forget to create a thumbnail for every one of my videos. I would like to batch my thumbnails 
I've got a green screen, I've got some backdrops. I can start playing with some formats. I think I, I did remember to get a thumbnail for this video though, so that's good. But yeah, for all the past ones I've been doing, I keep forgetting, and so I just take a frame from the video. It works, but it's I'd like them to look better than that. Anyways, if you're enjoying this series and you'd like to see more, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!